No matter what your sport, the St. Cloud area has a place for you. The key to success is passion. And that's true in business and in sports. Our passion for the sports industry is strong. St. Cloud is the place of legends. You've got to have heart. I'm Amanda Smock. I'm 31 years old and I grew up in Melrose, Minnesota. I started triple jumping um, in seventh or eighth grade, junior high track. One of my coaches suggested that I try triple jumping. I had done the long jump before that and then I did it all through high school and through college and it appealed to me so much um, after I was done competing in college that I just felt like I had more room to improve and more ground to cover so I wanted to keep with it. I guess off in the back of my mind I had pictured one day dreaming of being an Olympian and, and thankfully that dream came true and I did get a chance to compete at the Olympics. The Olympic trials for track and field are in the end of June, typically about two months right before the Olympic Games. So it wasn't until then that I really had punched my ticket to get to the Olympic Games. and. Um, it was on my last jump in the final round of competition that I knew that I was going to be an Olympian. I landed in the pit and stepped out of the pit and they immediately handed me my American flag and I was sent on my victory lap and I was waving the flag and waving to the crowd and my whole family was there. I had about 30 of my aunts and uncles and friends and um, it was in Oregon and they drove out there to see me. It was a pretty cool moment. Tight grip on this emotion. I don't want to lose it. I might slip as I'm growing, but in progress I'll excuse it as long as I learn and don't repeat my mistakes. The Olympic Games were uh, very surreal. Um, really a magical experience. When I finally arrived at the Olympic Games, it was literally a dream come true. And the opening ceremonies happened on my 30th birthday. And that in itself was an unbelievable experience to be walking side by side with the world's greatest athletes. Everything about the Olympics was unbelievable. Some of the, the biggest challenges are the state of the U.S. women's triple jump on the world scene. Um, we're not quite as talented as the rest of the world, so funding is an issue because of that. And so for a long time I did it with zero dollars and I would most often just compete locally to try and improve. Um, thankfully, once I um, made the Olympic team, some sponsors started coming through. So now I'm sponsored by ASICS, the shoe company, and the New York Athletic Club. And they um, you know, fund a lot of my competitions, a lot of my gear. There's a lot more opportunities to compete with um, competitions where there's prize money involved. So this year, signs are pointing towards probably competing towards Rio. I just won my fifth national title at this past indoor game. So things this season are progressing well. I'm happy where I'm at whether or not I've competed, I most likely will stay in the field of athletics, most certainly in the coaching avenue. I started coaching this past season at McAllister College, the horizontal jumps, and I have absolutely loved it. It's so fun to see the progression of the athletes and be involved in that aspect. I'm Amanda Smock. Thanks for watching Legends of the Cloud.